development in the race for a coronavirus vaccine. Pharmaceutical company Moderna says its testing shows its vaccine is more than 94% effective against coronavirus. The company plans to apply for emergency use authorization from the government after it gathers more safety data this month. Moderna expects to have 20 million doses ready to ship by the end of 2020 and says it is on track to produce up to a billion doses in 2021. Well, doctors at UMMC shared some relieving news about COVID-19 treatments on the way. And this news couldn't come soon enough while cases continue to spike and holidays are around the corner. 12 News' Alex Love joins us now in studio with who can access the plans and what doctors are up against. Alex? So besides Pfizer and Moderna, both producing vaccines with a 90% or more efficiency rate, which could be ready for health workers or, or certain vulnerable people between now and Christmas, an antibody treatment option is right around the corner for some patients at a time when hospitals need some breathing room. As of Monday afternoon, doctors of the University of Mississippi Medical Center reported there's no available ICU beds in Jackson hospitals, making an antibody treatment option for some patients crucial to lower hospitalizations. This particular antibody has got an uh, emergency use authorization just for outpatients. So it's uh, patients in high-risk group down to the age of 12 years old. The patients cannot be sick enough to be hospitalized, and it's one infusion. The benefit is to keep them out of the hospital, to keep them from decompensating more. This treatment is set for distribution in the next 48 hours, covered through the federal government. In the meantime, doctors are still predicting additions to the current spike to follow Thanksgiving. If I had to bet you a dollar today whether or not we will see a spike after the holidays, I would bet a dollar that we would. Um, I wish that we wouldn't, but I think that that is just the reality. If you do celebrate Thanksgiving, UMMC released some tips to do it safely, like making sure you and your guests get tested 48 hours before you see each other. Celebrate outdoors, no long distance traveling, and only do it with immediate family. People traveling from all over the country, I would say not a good idea because there are some other parts of the country right now that are actually seeing more active outbreaks than we're seeing here. You see somebody you haven't seen for a while, you're giving them lots of hugs and that sort of thing, and you don't know if they may have the virus. If this increase carries over, UMMC staff are most concerned if they can manage the manpower needs. Since some doctors and nurses are already forced to call out due to catching the coronavirus themselves or having close contact. To get the antibody treatment, patients must first test positive and then get access after meeting requirements through the UMMC emergency department. Administering the antibody would be covered by insurance.